What's going on, my fellow vampire blockers? You got your guy Larry here. Um, oh, like, subscribe, small channel. I'm gonna try to grow it. Hit you guys with some tidbits to just help people out where you're not a slave to this agenda that they have going on. Now, make it through the whole video. You gotta make it through the whole video because there's a lot of gems here that will literally save your life on stress um, and, you know, possibly snapping on somebody. Now, we live in a time where n nobody knows shit. Nobody knows anything. Everyone's aggressive, everyone's pissed off. You know, it's become the norm to not know. It's cool not to know shit. Excuse me, did you know what aisle the, um, the uh, rice is in? Oh, I don't know. Excuse me, do you know how much these tires are? Ooh, ooh, ooh. It used to be, excuse me, I don't know, but I'll find somebody who does know. And I'll get back to you, sir. Okay. Now, I'm just gonna get into this next thing. That this weekend, this this up uh, past weekend, even when you're going to work or you're dealing with foremans, bosses, supers, whoever's in control, who we, you know, whoever runs the show or whoever thinks they run the show, you ever notice they know the least amount of shit? So I had an issue this weekend. I show up to work, clear mistake. I say, uh, yeah, that this is a mistake. Oh, well, you go to see so-and-so. No, you're the foreman. You could fix this right now. Oh, but you gotta, you see how easy it was to deflect the bullshit onto somebody else? He didn't wanna fix the problem. He would rather push it off to somebody else who has no clue what it, what's even going on. So that person ended up saying, okay, well, you know, he could have fixed this, but it is what it is. It ended up being a whole big melee. I said, you know what? Peace. I'm leaving. Don't even worry about it. Don't even check me in. I'm leaving. But you're going to leave and mess up the money? Do you see what they do? Mess up the money? I got money, man. It is what it is. You didn't want to fix the problem. Now you got to work short. Yeah, but I'm short three people. No, you're short four because I'm going home. I'm going in the pool. Now, he could have fixed the problem. Do you see how he made a bigger problem by not taking care of the little problem that could have been fixed? I don't care. I'll lose the money. It is what it is. Money doesn't run me. It really doesn't. When you get to a place where your time is more valuable than money, You'll live a very pure, clean life, I'm telling you. When money does not run you, when, when you don't have massive bills and massive pileups of just crazy nonsense bills and credit card debt and car payments and all this crazy shit, you will live a very clean life, a very pure, oh, I don't, I don't have to worry about it. Like, I don't, I don't have to do that now because, because of the money. You, you, you know, you start to come to work and you go, okay, I'm coming to work. This is how much I need for me to live comfortable. This is how much I need to invest, but I don't got to be here all day taking bullshit because I need the money. They don't mess with people who don't need the money. They don't mess with those people. You don't think these jobs know you live in a big ass house or you drive an expensive ass car, you gotta eat more shit than the guy who drives a 10 year old car who packs his lunch. The guy that shows up to work every day with Starbucks, uh, $80,000 car and talks about all, all the vacation homes or the big house he has when everybody else around him may make the same amount of money but they're living a cheaper life, that guy has to eat more shit. He has to do more hours and everybody else you mark my words on that now people more people now are on antidepressants there's more mental illness now than ever why do you think that is because they're slaves to a society of gimme 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 I gotta get bigger I gotta get faster no do what's best for you don't go to work doing favors. Do your job and get out of there and build your net worth. 
you will live a much cleaner life. That's how you deal with bosses, supers, foremans, co-workers. There's light at the end of the tunnel when you say, hey, I'm building my, I'm working for me. You do what you gotta do what's best for you. How many people say to you, hey, uh, um, how long are you staying today? Hey, I, hey, I'm staying as long as I need to and, and then I'm out of here. Do what you need to do for yourself. Don't let money control you. Don't let people control you with money. Do what's best for you and your family. All right, no regrets. Hope this helps out. Stay away from toxic people, okay? And if something doesn't feel right at work, they're probably somebody else turned them down and said they ain't doing it, so they're trying to push it onto your plate. Have a great day.